In September 2023, the federal government saw a complete shutdown. This had serious implications for the United States as a whole. Without the government working, all essential services were either halted, or experienced significant delays. There was no one to enact legislation, nor was there proper way to monitor financial aid and work being done. The severe lack of finance and resources meant that vital government programs were either put on hold or ceased altogether. This led to drastic cutbacks on staff, programs, and services. Essential services such as national security, health care, and food assistance were all affected. Without the safety nets of these essential services, the people of the U.S. were put at risk. Public health care was no longer supported, leaving medical care and treatments for those in need in precarious positions. Then, incomes and jobs were affected as no new tax revenues were streaming in as they had been before. Even those still employed were faced with reduced wages due to the economic impact of the shutdown. The national security infrastructure took a hit, as well, as military operations and defense projects were put on hold. The U.S. was left vulnerable to international threats, as their way to handle them was no longer available. Most importantly, perhaps, the citizens of the U.S. were rendered unable to support themselves and their families, as the welfare state had disappeared. The most basic of government services had become unavailable, such as air traffic control, tax collection, and public housing. As a result, the private sector found itself in a vulnerable position due to reduced regulation and oversight from the government. In addition, food assistance programs, which had previously offered support for those in need, no longer existed. This left vulnerable citizens and families without access to food, or with reduced access to meals. With the U.S. becoming increasingly reliant on the government for support in all areas of life, the shutdown caused a crisis. Many of the services that had been taken for granted now had to be provided by the private sector. Businesses had to step in and fill the void, leading to a large influx of capital into the private sector, far beyond what the government had been providing. The effects of the shutdown were felt in almost every area of life, and the U.S. was left with a large economic hole it needed to fill. As a result of the shutdown, citizens faced significant hardship and uncertainty, and the U.S. economy took a major blow as a whole. Much of the crisis resulted from the fact that the government was unable to provide essential services, such as health care and public safety. This lack of coverage was especially difficult for those who relied on government assistance for food and shelter, as these services suddenly disappeared. The government was unable to monitor or control the influx of capital into the private sector, leading to instability in the financial market. Businesses had to adjust suddenly and face the challenge of what the new financial landscape would look like after the shutdown.